in this lecture we will talk about the last principle of scamper which stands for reverse the letter r is not necessarily associated with reverse it can also be used to represent reduce rearrange or even remove attempt to reverse the flow of information input or the general directional flow in itself can give disproportionate advantage some of the most unconventional solutions can be obtained by applying this principle of scamper a simple and everyday example of reversing the operation is that of a table fan and an exhaust fan both of them use the same principle but in the reverse a fan that you see on the ceiling or the one on your table pulls the air from its back and pushes it to the front on the other hand the one that you fit on the window the exhaust fan does exactly the reverse thus using the same principle same engineering we are able to get different functions let's now look at some tips or some triggers which will help you to ask the right questions in manufacturing should we turn something around should we make it up instead of down or should we make it down instead of up can we interchange the components in service sector ask questions such as what if we had to do turn codes with the customer what if we consider it in backwards instead of the information flowing to the customer can the information flow back from the customer to us for example when you traditionally go for getting a air ticket booked the agent would do the data entry but now as a customer you use a web interface and you key in your own details so the information now is being fed in, fed in by you rather than being fed in by the agent or by a data entry operator considering that both of them are on different sides one being the vendor and the other being the customer and finally we can also view this principle from leadership and strategic perspective in the following ways what if we try doing exactly the opposite what we originally intended to do what if we remove the existing approach altogether what if we stop calling or following up our clients what happens the clients might start calling us back so certainly the principle can be applied in multiple areas so with that we are almost done with all the principles of scamper now we will talk about some tips and benefits of scamper in the next lecture